Hey guys, welcome back to All the Popcorn. My name is Stephanie. Thank you all for clicking on this video. If you're someone who enjoys talking about film, how about clicking that subscribe button? So today we're gonna to be talking about one of Netflix's newest films this week, Oxygen. <laughs> Now, Oxygen was released on Netflix on May the 12th. It is directed by Alejandro Aja, which I'm sure I didn't say his name right. Um, but he did direct uh, Craw, which came out in 2019, which I absolutely love. It does star Melanie Neron, who did star at one of Quentin Tarantino's films, one of my favorite ones, Glorious Bastards. Um, and here she's playing Elizabeth or Liz, a woman who wakes up in a cry cryogenic... Cryo... <laughs> wakes up in this very high-tech pod you guys and has absolutely no memory of how she got there and what is happening so this is one of those claustrophobic like mystery thriller kind of movies we are set in one single location which is this very high-tech pod now personally i'm not somebody who enjoyed these kind of like one location kind of films especially when we are somewhere like in this claustrophobic literally not just in one location like i can i can get jiggy with you know just being like in a house or something like that just being the one location we're in but we're literally like in one tiny little like coffin type of deal and i get it it's to give you that claustrophobic feel to it I do have a little bit of claustrophobia just, just a tiny bit tiny bit do want to make this video really quick because i am on my lunch break but as you can tell we're in a new setting if you're new this is not my typical setting here but isn't the lighting perfect look at me i can be with my glasses i don't have to be blind for this because i don't have my ring light oxygen in this pod that she's in the oxygen is set to run out in about 100 minutes which is the length of the movie so she is just trying to figure out how she got there who she is because remember she doesn't have her memory and she's trying to like escape she's trying to find help towards the end of it honestly for me personally that's when the thrilling portion of it happened <laughs> my nail was attacking my hair that's kind of when the you know thrilling part happened the beginning part of the movie i just ugh, it was boring you guys the beginning part of it i'm not even gonna lie i was just like oh my god i had like no connection to elizabeth these type of movies you have to have sympathy for this character you have to be in there with the character and i just didn't connect with her i was watching it but at the same time like i'm like well when is something gonna happen there is one two kind of like jump scares kind of like just something just kind of happens and just kind of like pops up right obviously that's a jump scare and i was about to like turn up the tv i said uh-uh is we about to get scary up in here but no it was just something that happened and then we do of course get hit with uh flashbacks you know because again she's trying to figure out who she is how she got there what's happening and all that other good juicy stuff but it's not that juicy in my own personal opinion it's just really not juicy but again i don't want to linger on this video because i am on my break and i do plan on filming two videos here before i do give you my final score if you haven't already go ahead and give this video a like subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time that i post something new i am trying to hit 400 subscribers before the end of the month you can kind of hit that as a birthday present it is my birthday month it's actually on wednesday on the 19th we're a few days away so oxygen not a thrilling movie i honestly didn't expect it to be that thrilling when i saw the, the trailer i was like ah I guess now that thrilling feel for me personally came in that third act obviously that's when everything kind of was starting to get revealed we do get kind of like two big kind of reveals there so with all that said um i am still gonna only give oxygen a small popcorn i guess it's pretty pretty close to a medium uh, just because of those three little aspects to it which honestly i had absolutely no idea that that's where they were gonna end up because i'm just like wait what's happening and then like then we get this other thing and i go wait what that's happening too just that like thrilling portion of it didn't sell it quite enough for me to give it that higher rating um if you have seen oxygen let me know down below what did you think about it did you like it did you love it did you hate it was it just not for you are you into these kind of claustrophobic thriller type of films which one is your favorite go ahead and comment down below and until next time i'll see you guys at concessions bye